page here in my kitchen. Isn't it a beaut? Today we're going to be making for you some butter stew. We all know we love the butter in the south. So what we have here, let me show you a little close up. Come on close. Here we have some nice lard of lamb. Look at that. It is just perfection right there. We have a little regular house butter and we're going to make that into some garlic butter. We have over here some regular house butter too. That's just going to stay that house butter. And then we have here our special no salt, no added oil butter. And here we have some vegetable oil right here. This is the secret ingredient, so don't tell anyone. This is what is going to make the money in this family right here. Also, we have our garlic salt. Now, the most important thing when you are cooking in the kitchen is you want to wash your hands first. So we are going to go house on just a little squirt a little rinsey rinse right here mm -hmm. rinse those hands shake shake all right so right here we're just gonna start we're gonna get a little bit of that regular house butter just stab it there with the knife give it a little shake shake down into the bowl mm -hmm. we are gonna get about a half a ounce of some garlic powder remember that garlic powder this one is our Laurie's brand it's good old southern a little half ounce. Mm -hmm. We just eyeballing that one. For if you get a little cautious about it, you can just get out your half ounce cup, give it a little shaky shake. We're gonna coat that butter. Mm -hmm. Just roll that butter. Roll it, roll it, roll it. We're rolling and we're rolling. All right, and then what we want to do? We just want to turn on our burner. We're just gonna turn it on to medium. That's a good old sizzling heat right there. But before we do that. After we do that, we're going to give ourselves a little bit of some EVOO, you know what I'm saying, extra virgin olive oil. Give it a little dash, give it a little twirl, and give it another little dash. Mm. Just the right enough, just to brown that butter just a smidge. Right. As you can see, we have been cooking for quite some time now. That butter is just getting a little crispy with that nice garlic coating. Giving it a little swirl, not letting it hit on the bottom of the pan for too long. We don't want to brown that butter too dark, just a little light browning. Now while he's just sitting there and marinating in his goodness, we are going to grab ourselves that other pads of butter. Just pull out. Doesn't matter what order, they're all going the same place. Pull out. Pull out. Get them down in there. Mmm. This is just... Smelling mighty fine. Woo! All right, now this butter stew is just smelling delicious. And then I just pour it into our serving bowl. Nice and smooth, no chunks. Mmm! Give it a little swirly swirl in the bowl. Now, Mama always told me the best way to know if your cooking is on point is to ask your friends. All right, Come just in. a little, little spoonful, okay? Oh Are you ready? No. No spitting on me. Okay. If it's what bad. Wait, wait, wait. One, two, three. Oh. It's delicious. She said so. I heard what her. Is you. What is it? Good. That was a great face. She loves it. Now, could you just give us a little taste of taste right here? Yes, <laughs> oh, she loves delicious. it. Mmm. She is as honest as a piece of pie on a hot summer day. I'll tell you what. Mm. Mm. Yummy, yummy, yum. Mm -hmm. I want some pizza. Yes. Yeah. It tastes mm -hmm. a big old butt. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> She's just overjoyed. Oh, she loves it. From my kitchen to yours. See y'all later.